welcome to the five minute auto pairing next game so let's go let's go five minute auto pairing it's quite early in the morning at the moment of this game I wonder how many title players are on UK time 45 uh, well it'd be quick to get a game Bit of a delay. All right, so we got a game. Fish puppy. <clears throat> An early bishop f5. Let's try and do this. Construct this center with tempo. Mind you, there is that. Um, might be able to do this. Maybe just Finchetto. Probably just Finchetto. I've got a grip on um, on d5. Oh, I can pin the knight. Oh, that could be annoying. Oh, I better do something about that just before that's a disaster. Uh, Actually, knight d5 here. I'm looking on that diagonal. Oh, I think there's going to be, um, unfortunately, I think there's going to be a bishop f4, which is going to be unpleasant. Or knight takes f3. I think I should castle. I think knight f3, queen c3. Although I'm not entirely sure that's any good. There's knight e5 minimum. Or knight f4. No, not knight f4, queen h8. Knight e5. And that knight on f4 is a problem again. Hmm. I'm in trouble here. Yeah. Ah, okay, let's just try and just lose one pawn, not two, if possible. Mind you, Queen F4 is going for a second pawn. I mean, Queen C3, but no, Queen C3, I don't think that's Queen F3. Ideally, I just want bishop e2 and use the g file. That'll be some compensation here. Uh, losing the second pawn is a bit much. Hmm. Yeah. Why not, I guess? Why not? It makes the e5 knight good. Bishop c1 here? Isn't that just skewing? It's got queen h3. I'll take away the h3 square first. So I'm trying to set up bishop c1. Also h5 could be dangerous. Bishop d4 is another forcing move. But bishop c1. I'm trying to skew without queen h3. <coughs> this then I get the queen out and just take on c7 I can evict his queen uh, bishop d4 what about bishop d4 trying to evict the queen with bishop d4 and then queen c7 and there's queen d6 after Mind you, if he's always lurking around on e4, this is a new problem, e4 pawn. I'm going to get that queen away from e4. So 
Bishops H G Rafa or Bishop E five C six maybe Yeah, C six is a pain. I'll just try and kick the Queen again or H G I mean H G first. Try to open up some lines. I assume this is it's gonna protect C seven. Uh huh. Can I go for a crude queen h2? Try and put his king safety. A question to his king safety. Um, I might just park the bishop back here. He's got c4. But then maybe, uh, okay, I think maybe that's, you know, keeping the pressure on h8 potentially. So queen h2, queen h8 potentially. If his knight moves, queen h8. <coughs> Bishop G4 is also now possible. Oh, okay. I think Knight F3 I can just take. He's not on B2. No, probably this check is not quite dangerous yet. Hmm, but maybe I should throw it in. Throw it check. In. So bishop e5, there's no bishop e5, queen f7. I'm going to attack the queen here, or bishop c1. Like rook, I think, yeah, keep the queen away from, uh, I don't know actually. Uh, my my diagonal is pretty weak here. Uh, his knight on e5 is very, very good. If I can get to play bishop g5 and queen h8, oh that's not all bishop h8, yeah. Like bishop h8, queen d3, bishop c2. Check. Okay. Um, I was going to attack my queen now. That's not very pleasant. Oh. Drop it all the way back because I just know it's queen d3. Oh, this is not good. Oh, he's just blundered his queen. That helps. Oh, that's an unfortunate game. Ah, uh, yeah, he just blundered in the end. He had he had me there. Good position. Oh well. Unfortunate. Uh, comments or questions on YouTube. Thanks so much.